Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm Rakim Mishra and in this video we are going to fix this error, right? Whenever we are running this Maven project from the Jenkins and if we get this error, right? We are kind of, you know, go clueless, right? Everything was proper. We were able to, you know, pull the project and we were uh, uh, able to run it locally also. But as in when we start the execution from the Jenkins, we get this error. Okay, so what is this error? Unknown lifecycle phase MVN. You must specify the valid lifecycle phase or goal in the long error, right? And you'll see the error, error, error. And uh, yeah, so how, how to fix this error when your project is all fine and you were able to, you know, run your project locally also. Okay, so it is very, very uh, tricky and very simple fix. Just go to the Maven and just go to the configure and check how you are running this, you know, particular, you know, project. Everything seems to be fine because you are running, pulling the GitHub repository. You are going, uh, okay. You are pulling your project from this. Okay. Here somewhere. So your project is here. Okay. Nothing wrong with the project. All pom.xml, everything is right there. Now you are running, you just check against the branch, main branch. Everything is from the main only, okay? Until you give any other branch, everything is all fine. So this is how you can check like what all error can come up or pop up, right? Now here, go to the steps where you have given the uh, root of POM. It also seems to be uh, fine because it is picking up, right? Okay, as per the error. Now goal and options, right? That error, that error was related to that MVN phase, right? So in this case, since it is Maven project, you don't need this option explicitly to be passed. Okay. So rather you just specify the target. Okay. You can see, you can pass all those um, argument and such as clean install or deploy. You have to provide the target. Okay. You don't need to provide the MVM, those commands. Okay. It will be taken care. So now go ahead and apply the save and just build now again, build it. So you can see the previous one was failed. Now this should be all fine. Okay. So let us see if that error is there or not. See, it has get passed. It get passed that error, that phase. And now it is executing that, um, those test. Okay. You can see all your tests are getting executed. You can forget about, uh, you can just park it aside. This is no relevant. Okay. Once in a while you will get this error until you pass you know, remote allow version to the Chrome driver or driver you are going to use for the automation. You may get this warning. Okay. You can, and uh, here you can see your test, your feature file has been picked up and scenario are getting executed. Okay. And there is no error as such build is successful. So that is how you can get past that error, which we have seen in the build file this was the error just in case if you get unknown lifecycle phase mvn you have to uh, remove mvn from the option okay and give the target so that's it from the video and i hope you have liked the explanation and learned from this video please do like and subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends and also share the feedback in comment section and i will see you in the next video till then keep learning and thanks for watching